So my name is Jenna Wilkins. We are in Richmond, Missouri, and we are showing Sarah around our beet distillate project. Um, this was something that was inspired by conversations between myself, a farmer, and a small scale local distillery of the Earth Farm Distillery. And we wanted to create a spirit um, that was made from beets. So we wrote a SARE grant and were awarded funds to try that out. Um, so myself and two other farmers are growing beets to convert the sugars into alcohol and concentrate them with the small still. So we are about six months into the two year project and so far we've experimented with making alcohol out of three different types of beets and have successfully distilled one type, sugar beets, which have the most sugar. And now we're looking to figure out how to increase yields with the next few batches and marketing the product as a savory spirit locally. Beets are um, an interesting Thing to experiment with because they do have some sugar which we thought might lend itself to a fermentation process and because they're so aromatic and represent um, like a very savory flavor within vegetables we thought that that would be different in the the scene of all um, spirits and alcohols that are out there the Sarah Grant has been really helpful because it provided, obviously, the, the startup costs needed to just do the experiment. So being able to compensate farmers for their time, um, compensate the distillery for the distillation services, and once we have a product, hopefully um, be able to bottle and label it. Um, and then also, as a farmer working within the project, it's been helpful for me to have the framework and the timeline um, provided by Sarah and um, that provides motivation to stay on track and if we run into obstacles, um, work harder to overcome them and, and find new, new ways of doing things or, um, or solve problems we run into. I think it would be helpful to small growers, um, especially because it um, is another way to add value to their vegetable products. So if it works to turn beets into alcohol, um, distilleries may be able to pay farmers a more premium price for their beets than they would get at a farmer's market potentially. Um, and it could be an interesting opportunity to farmers in um, marketing their farms to different avenues.